Uh, welcome to, to the Chemistry Academy to introduce a molecular docking using auto tools lecture by Mahmoud Abdul Latif. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Ahlan bikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Academy of Chemistry 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 Academy of
okay we deleted this chain and the crystal structure of the uh, protein contains hetero atoms and also contain water molecules you have to delete both of them i delete the hetero atom from select uh, select from the string just hit hetero atoms just add them so there are many and go to the delete edit delete selected atoms okay the next step just to delete water molecule from edit to delete water okay and just to have to add polar hydrogen uh, just add polar only okay it looks like this one exactly and the next step just to add it charges add Coleman charge okay very very nice now we have prepared the protein and then we have to insert the ligand just to go to the ligand here and just input and just open open it okay it should be actually I, I, I downloaded it in MDL format just I uh, set the pass for the file which is this one as you have seen okay okay and just the output it should be in bdbqt format just make it ligand ligand li, li, ligand just save and just click uh, I haven't said it right now, not yet. I got it from this one, really. Okay, nice. And this I'll just convert. It's, it's one molecule convert, just go there to the working directory. You will sign ligand, which I have downloaded. Okay, I've changed it to BDBQ format, and then I go to the Autodact tool again and just go to ligand just input open you will find this one and this is the ligand okay there are many 18 uh, torsion there are 18 just say this one just rotate to see the ligand okay this one okay this is the ligand don't be uh, fear from uh, saying the ligand far from the protein doesn't really matter uh, okay now i should go to the ligand again and just detect root for the ligand okay and just uh, you can see torsion tree to see choose torsion you will find this one you, it's the the green one it's 18 and the number of the uh, bonds uh, shouldn't be increased than 32 I leave it as it is just done okay and just go to uh, okay now I put the ligand in PDBQ format and okay now I should go to the grid and just choose the macro molecule choose this one select a molecule okay and just you have to uh, save it as receptor dot pdbqt format just save and do the same just grid set map types for choose ligand just choose it you have already choose uh, bdbq format okay now it's nice we have done uh, uh, we have reached a good point now we have the two uh, two molecules the protein and it's receptor one and the uh, ligand molecule and now how we have to set the most important set to set the grid box the grid box this is the most important thing okay if you don't know the active site of the protein you can use p 
plan docking and you should cover the whole area of the uh, protein by the grid box and it's better actually the calculation is affected by the size by the size of the grid box so it's better to know the active sites actually for for these for this for this uh, one i went to the reference paper for by these people and got the active sites for this protein which are uh, this one 165 167 192 and 198 just go to the this one to show them okay click this arrow Okay, 100, this one, and this one, I think 100, uh, this one, I think, just uh, have a look again, uh, okay, this one, and this one. Okay. Okay, I have show them. So I sh this area should be covered with the grid box. Okay, I have seen in many tutorial they use this one. Just the right click and write 0.5 here. Okay, and the offset. This one it's minus 17. I have known it minus 17 point 124 and this one it's 11 point 955. I did it before and you know the the dimension of the grid box and this one 68 point you see it's the all all the uh, active sites have been uh, have been covered the, with the grid box and this is I would say it's a good uh, it's not standard but it's 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 better okay just you can i think it's okay and just save this one file close saving current you have saved the grid box okay nice now you can uh, you have to save the output for the grid save just grid dot grid parameter file format just save and now go to the uh, run okay just auto grid you have to set the path auto, uh, this is auto grid okay and then uh, browse the file I'm, s I'm wondering why where is it i have saved it grid Ugh. it's g not q g okay have been seen there just use this one and just open and just hit launch now it's working very nice once this one it's disappear okay so i will stop at this point and continue in the next uh, part okay until we meet again i hope i hope i wish you all the best